Hi everyone, Connor here from Team Block Demon, and today I'd like to show you how to get started staking your Solana tokens through the Solflare wallet by using your Ledger hardware device. By following along this guide, you can get up and running with staking your Solana tokens as soon as possible. It's important to note from the outset, however, that both your Solflare wallet and your Ledger hardware device are both non-custodial wallets. That means that you retain full control of your own private keys and your funds through the entire process of your staking journey. But with all that in mind, let's jump into how to get started staking your Solana tokens by using the Solflare wallet and your Ledger hardware device. So let's jump in. So because I want to stake Solana with Solflare and Ledger, the first thing I'll do is download Ledger on desktop. I've already completed this step and you can see that I'm using a Ledger Nano S with no apps installed. The first thing I'll need to do is click on Manager on the left side panel and then open the app catalog. Because we're interested in Solana staking, I'll search for Solana in this app catalog and then install the Solana app. Next, we want to add an account. So I'll click on the add account button. Simply open the Solana app on your Ledger device and follow the instructions on screen. I'll call my account Connor Solana for the purposes of this tutorial. Once we've set up our new Solana account, we'll see this appear in the account screen in the Ledger app. Make sure that you keep the Solana app on your physical Ledger device open during the staking process. Next, I'll download the Solflare wallet. To do this, I'll visit solflare.com and then click download. You'll see that Solflare is available for Chrome, iPhone and Android. However, I'm interested in the Chrome browser extension, so I'll click Chrome. When I click on the browser extension, I'll see the option to either create or recover a wallet or connect with Ledger or Keystone. I'll choose Ledger, then make sure if you're following along with this guide to connect your Ledger, unlock it and open the Solana app on your physical Ledger device. We'll see a pop-up up here that Solflare wants to connect to Ledger Nano S, so I'll click on the physical device and then click connect. Next, I'll select a password and then click continue. Now I'll need to select a derivation path, which I'll do to continue. Once that's all done, I'll see that I have an empty wallet that's all set up. I'll next top up my account with some funds that I'd like to stake by clicking on the receiving address and sending some sol to that address. Now that I've topped up my account, you can see that I have around $81 worth of sol tokens. I'd like to stake this, so I'll click on the staking option in the top nav bar. We'll now be given three different options to begin staking. I'm interested in staking with Block Demon, so I'll choose native sol staking. On this tab, click the large Start Staking button. Now, choose how much SOL you'd like to start staking. I'm interested in staking most of my tokens, so I'll choose 2.48 SOL. However, it's recommended to leave a small amount of SOL to pay for transaction fees for both processing the staking transaction and if you'd like to unstake at any stage. Both of these actions require some small transaction fees. Next, choose the validator that you'd like to stake with. I'd like to stake with Block Demon, so I'll choose Block Demon by typing Block Demon in the validator search bar, and then I'll see this validator name return. Now you have the option to review the transaction before clicking stake. Before clicking stake, however, be sure to make sure that your Ledger device is unlocked and the Solana app is open. Once I'm happy with everything, I'll choose stake. Confirm the transaction on your physical Ledger device. Now wait a few moments for the transaction to be confirmed and you'll be automatically redirected to a new screen showing that your staking was indeed successful and your transaction is confirmed. You can see that the status is set to activating. This is because it takes around two to three days for the stake to become active, after which time the status will change and you will be successfully getting staking rewards for participating in the Solana network through staking. So there you have it. That is how you get set up staking your Solana tokens all through Solflare and your physical ledger device. I hope you found this tutorial useful. And if you have any questions around the staking process, or if you'd like to learn more about the staking process of other chains, please feel free to reach out to us directly or visit our YouTube channel for more staking guides. But until next time, I hope you have a great day and take care.